The Miami Marlins are a better team than a lot of people think and not that far off from contention. Now they say they're waiting to see what happens right before the trade deadline to see if they should add or subtract off this roster. Personally, I don't see them as a contender this year, but they certainly have taken a step forward even without the exciting young pitcher Jose Fernandez. We've seen Henderson Alvarez, who was acquired in that big deal with Toronto a couple of years ago, emerge as an all-star. Nathan Eovaldi has a premium arm in that rotation. And we've seen some of the younger pitchers come up from the minor leagues and also flash real power stuff. They've built a very good collection of young arms in Miami. And the addition of Casey McGee has just been an unbelievable find for the Marlins, considering last year they had Placido Polanco batting behind John Carlos Stanton. McGee has forced people to deal with Stanton, and McGee is cashing in without the long ball with the RBIs. Now, be prepared once again to hear rumors about John Carlos Stanton being traded. There's a reason for that. Everybody wants the guy. But also, you can disregard the rumors. The Marlins are not moving Stanton, certainly not in July and probably not even after this season. He is the cornerstone of this franchise moving forward, and they will wait as long as possible in terms of holding on to him and trying to sign him to an extension.